Hello, so if you are trying to mount your EFS to your EC2 instance and you are getting this error up here, what you want to do is, the first thing is close your SSH session. I'm just going to close it. Then come to your EC2, so under service, under compute, select EC2 and select your running instances and click your running instance. Verify if you have your public DNS here. And if you don't have this public DNS, and this is what is causing it. This is how I solved my, cause I couldn't mount it. And I noticed that I didn't have the public DNS. So what you want to do to get that is under services, select VPC, then select your VPCs. This demo VPC is where my EFS and my EC2 instance is in. So I'll select that VPC. So select the VPC that your EFS and your EC2 instance is in. Then come to actions. Then click edit DNS host names. And you want to enable this. And click save. And we can just refresh this page. So let's go back to our EC2 again. I go back to EC2. Select running instances. Select that instance. You can see it now has a DNS host name. So now what you want to do is you can SSH back into your EC2 instance and run your mount command again and it should work. So I'm going to SSH back into my instance. So I have now SSH into my EC2 instance. The next thing I'm going to do is paste my mount command in here and press enter. And you see that it worked that time. So once you enable that DNS host name in your VPC and you verify that your EC2 has a DNS name, wait a couple of minutes. You might have to wait a couple of minutes. I had to wait a couple of minutes for this to work. So I'll say give it about two, three minutes. Then SSH into your EC2 instance and run the mount command again and it should work. This is how you solve this problem. Thank you and I'll see you in the next lecture. Bye.